Hello everyone, welcome back to another vlog. If you can tell, my voice is gone because I'm a uh, sicko mode. That was cringe, let me stop. But I thought today I would vlog because I'm gonna go grocery shopping and also clean my apartment, which I know I do in every vlog, but like, listen, the common space area is pretty clean as you can see, but the room is not. And also I have like laundry to do in the closet and all that stuff. So it's just gonna be like a living in New York City alone. But girl, she does not live alone no more. So she cannot be doing the living alone in New York City vlogs anymore because- Bye. Kaylee. I'm Kaylee. I'm I know Studio you're about Diego. to draw so many yeah. things on your screen right now. Oh, oh wow. Pop off, future oh, Kaylee. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. Would you like to give yourself a little introduction? My name is Kaylee Sandoval. Hello. Nice to meet you guys. I'm a New York City girly now. I'm from San Diego. Just graduated San Diego State and I'm mm -hmm. a graphic designer and editor. So you'll be seeing more of me. Yep. There we go. So the girly pop lives in the, the little family household now. She literally just got here like yesterday night and I know everyone was like, oh, like why do you need a six bedroom apartment to live alone like this is so big and yeah i got that but we were planning and like scheming this whole time we're just gonna do a little jump scare Ow. so this oh, is is. gonna be her room so little moving vlogs part two but we're gonna be going shopping right now so you know just go get some groceries and also guys i got a new bike let me show you this is my bike what do we think it's literally a big boy bike like it has a battery and everything but it's an electric bike with like a two a seater so that's what we're gonna be doing it to go around town today so enjoy the vlog sterling is ready to go. Oh, he looks so cute. All right, we're currently at Trader Joe's. We're gonna go grocery shopping, go get some things. So why do you love Trader Joe's so much? I don't know, because they have the best of the best. I love their wraps. Mm -hmm. I love their fried rice. I love mm -hmm. their sauces, their chips. They have Takis that are- Okay. Okay. I like that they have like pre-made things. Me too. I just think cook. Yeah, I just think that Trader Joe's is the aesthetic. Honestly, I usually just shop wherever, but since I have the bike now, we can we can actually go to the places the that. The bike is so fun. Right? You're just yeah. ripping everywhere. It's so fast, truly. Oh, and the apples are the best apples. They're so sweet, so yummy. Y'all need to try. I'm gonna try a grocery shopping method called only buy what you actually will eat, not what you think you'll eat. Okay, what's the first cop of the day? I need even chive cream cheese spread. All right, and what do you spread? With it, like what's the what's the deliver to the mouth? You know, like the deliver to the mouth. Like you can't just be eating a bagel. This. Oh, a bagel. Okay, a bagel. bagel. Broccoli, green beans. Look at how cute these tomatoes are. They're in this like plastic bag, but they're so cute. These are so good. But add a little more hot sauce, and it's better. This is so good with a little like Italian dressing in the pesto. I didn't mm. even know they sold these. Oh my gosh, I eat these all the time in Costa Rica. These gooseberries, and they're my favorite. This huge pack of blueberries are only eight ninety nine. Y'all are gonna scream at me for this, but when I was younger, I learned that before you grab fruit, you taste it and you see if it's sour or not. And I know you guys will be like, hey, no, to get well, fun fact, if something's frozen, don't get it organic because they don't need to be organic when they're frozen. I think that's what it is because like when they come right off of the farm, they freeze them right away so they don't put all those pesticides on it. Fun fact. And if you have fruit that's going bad, just freeze it so that you can put them in smoothies. Save money, live better. Okay, I think that's all we need. All right, clearly it's way later now. It's dark out, but she's having me try these rolled corn tortilla so chips. Like Duckies. But listen, y'all, I've never had a hot Cheeto. I like just, it's not my vibe. What are you doing this right now? It's a good, like, I'm editing. You're editing? Oh my God, what are you editing? Your video. Wait, you like edit or something? So cute. So back to these. So yummy, definitely an entry level spicy chip. Giving very much lime. I'm actually just trying to get like into spicy things. Like if there's like a ramen or something, mm -hmm. I won't choose like just the base. I'll choose like first level spicy. Okay, okay. okay. They're good. They're not that spicy. I'm scared. Just try it. They're good. Ooh. I mean, if you eat a lot of them, it, you can start to feel yeah, the spice yeah. a little. My tongue is definitely getting but like. These are way less spicy than like the actual chips. Well, that was the mukbang. I've been sitting here for the past, I don't even know how many hours. Hours. She took a whole nap and everything came out, and I'm still sitting here. I don't know what I've been doing. My groceries are still sitting out at the front, and I have not unboxed them yet. Oh my god, guys. Actually, look at this. I got my Crocs. Should I vlog this for like TikTok? Ooh. Guys, a very important package just came in the mail today. One of you guys DM me that these came out and I literally ordered them, ordered, ordered them right away. I just opened it like this when there was literally a girl. I got these. 
special edition Minecraft cross. And if you guys don't know, I am obsessed with Minecraft. I used to game on my PC day and night. And I got the extra gibbets with them too. Oh, I cannot wait to add these to my crop collection. Let's see how they look on. They look so... Brother, they're still connected. They look so good. Well, these are my new Crocs. Catch me actually wearing these every single day. Like, I just love that the gibbets are like actual blocks. If you guys don't know, I'm actually such a big Croc fan. Like, they were my number one brand deal that I wanted, and I actually got it eventually, but we still stand. I used to actually not wear any other shoe than Crocs. I just love me my Crocs, you know what I mean, babes? <gasps> guys, I forgot to tell you. This is what I've been doing for the past two hours as well. I called an airline because for some reason I've been trying to book this flight, and it just was saying, oh, like, not available not available and then be like, oh, available, not available. But I booked a trip for how many days? Not me just doing the math now and realizing that I'm gonna be gone for a month? No way. I did not mean to do that. No, I just don't think I know math. One. I just don't know math, that's all guys. For almost three weeks, I'm going to be gone leaving. But the thing is, I'm not even just gonna be gone for like, for one destination. We are going to multiple destinations with multiple different people, guys. So expect the travel vlogs, expect, actually don't expect anything because expectation leads to disappointment and babes, I don't want that. So she's back in her travel girly era, but in order to be back in her travel girly era, maybe she needs to get her life together here. Maybe she needs to eat healthy. Maybe she needs to, I don't know, clean her house so she doesn't leave it a pig's nest. Hey guys, welcome back to what's in my grocery bag. So if you're gonna grocery shop and you don't know what to do, you don't know any recipes, just do this. You wanna get two proteins, so that means tofu, chicken, salmon, any types of meat, anything that's protein. Then you wanna get three types of vegetables, so that could be like leafy, such as spinach, romaine lettuce, arugula, you know, maybe for a salad or something like that. Then you wanna get like two core vegetables, such as like broccoli, cauliflower, something like that that you can roast, have for lunch or something. And then you wanna get like two fruits that you can eat in the breakfast and snack on and then maybe some eggs or something. I guess that could be a protein, but like whatever you like to eat for breakfast and then a carb. So that could be like bread. I don't know, bread, you know what I mean? And that way, for breakfast, you're having your eggs or whatever else you like to eat for breakfast, oatmeal, with some fruit and your carb. Lunch, you're having your protein with some leafy greens. And then for dinner, you're having another protein. So I have salmon here with some other vegetable. So I have green beans and broccoli here. And you can also have that with some rice, anything like that. And then for my fruits, I have blueberries. I had a big tub of blackberries, but I literally ate it all in one sitting. We have some not so frozen raspberries and blueberries and strawberries. Whoops, let's put that away. We got some spinach. And then I got some cilantro for my little Mexican bowls that I used to make. I got some basil for the salmon. And then I also have my leafy green here. The spinach is for smoothies. This is my other one. This is the shredded cabbage. I got this for the Mexican bowl thing. And then I got a bunch of fruits. So I got some papaya. And then I also just got some grapes, golden berries. I loved eating these in Costa Rica. I got a lemon and a lime. And then I also got some garlic for cooking. You should always grab a garlic whenever you're in the grocery store. Some tomatoes for the Mexican bowls. And then I also got some like cowboy caviar. I don't know, it's just some salsa, but with corn, black bean, and pepper. And then I also got some green salsa. And then I got three apples, some almond milk for the coffee and lattes in the morning. And then lastly, just some cucumber for the Mexican bowls. So I hope that was an easy way of explaining how to grocery shop. But yeah, let's put these all away. Oh, okay, just put everything in the fridge, but I got some packages, so I thought we would just open them instead of letting them uncontrollably pile up. I have more out there, but I just grabbed a couple. I just like the logo on this, so I'm like, mm, what is it? Daily Greens, oh, okay, this is cool. Mushroom blend, all this stuff. Okay, I'm actually probably gonna use this every single day. Mix this in with your water, and they give you like a water bottle, that's cool. Oh, and then they, I like the packaging on this whole thing. Thank you, cool. Next is this one. Oh, it's from your mom, Ashley. She came out with her own merch. I like them. They're very soft. And then like, this is puffy, super cool. Thank you, Ashley. This is actually so soft. More packages. Ooh, Lancome. The Lash Edel Mascara and Liner. They sent me in the gray, the blue, and the brown, and the green. And then they also sent me a Lash Booster, and then also more of their Lash Edel Mascara. I love this mascara. It's definitely a bougie price, but if you guys haven't tried it already, try it. Thank you, Lancome. Tatcha. Ugh, I love this packaging. I'm actually gonna reuse this box. Introducing the Silk Serum. Oh, wow. Look at this. 
beautiful packaging. I use Tatcha quite a bit, so I can't wait to try this. Thank you, Tatcha. Next. Ooh, please tell me. I literally need a body oil. Oh my gosh, I was actually looking to buy one. But this is from South Har. But, oh wow. I love this packaging. A girl is in need of body oil, clearly, because what is this? Neon hippie. Shroom complex. Lip treatment. I'm gonna actually try this right now. Oh my gosh. This thing like vibrates. What the heck? This is literally a vibrator. Oh my god. <laughs> like, is it necessary for this to vibrate? It feels cool though. Smells good. It looks nice. I'm just confused as to what the vibration is for. Thank you. I'm actually gonna try to use it. Good morning. It is currently the next, is it, I don't know. Is it the next day? I don't know, but the weekend was hectic and the clou the Klaus girl, you can tell that I just woke up, but it's actually 12 o'clock. That's that's the catch. The house is a mess. I set up this projector thing last night and it was so cool. We were watching the movie like literally right there and I moved the couch here and now I get it. It's not the biggest sleigh. It's not the most aesthetic. But guys, we're not going for aesthetic right now. We're going for a practical, how can we get the most people in this house enjoying a movie? But the house is low key. It's not bad. It's just, there's all over the place. Now I know this looks bad, but it's not. I washed the bedding on my bed, so I gotta put that back on my bed. And then I have clean laundry all over the floor that I need to put away. Although it's 12 o'clock, first stop of the day. An energy drink. Now, listen, I don't drink energy drinks. Like, I literally don't. I don't know why this is in my fridge. Last time I had these, it literally tasted like crack. Like, it wasn't like, ooh, juice. It was like, oh my god, you can tell that this is an energy drink. Oh, 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 shit. oh, shit. oh, shit. oh, shit. oh shit. Why did I know that that was gonna happen and I still continue to open it? I don't know why I did that. If you guys have not tried this, this is the Poppy drink. I've seen people talk about Poppy online on Instagram and like influencers talk about it and I'm like, it's a scam. It's literally a scam. If influencers talk about it, it's probably a scam and they're just promoting it. But not gonna lie, it's actually good. I picked it up and all the other flavors, I've tried almost every single one now, they're good. But nothing hits the same as the Raspberry Rose one. This is literally so good and I actually think this is gonna be my addiction. Like, you know people are addicted to a lot of things, maybe Diet Coke, maybe some other things. But I think that this is gonna be my new addiction, the raspberry rose poppy. Now, poppy, if you're watching this, which you're definitely probably not, please send me cases so I can fill my fridge up with it. Because right now my fridge is filled up with concerningly white claw. But the thing is, like, I don't, I don't drink white claw. It's from people staying over at my house and buying white claw, thinking that they're gonna drink the white claw, but no one ends up finishing drinking their white claw. But we have the to-do list right here today. I'm gonna start off just by cleaning the house and making it look a little bit more organized, or else I actually won't be able to function. So it turns out it's actually 1 p.m. now. I don't know where the time is ticking, but at 7 p.m. tonight, I have a couple little girlies coming over and we're gonna do like a little paint night so i actually have to get things done because i actually have something to do tonight just kidding guys i've been trying to like be more social lately not me getting nervous talking about it i've been more social lately say hi kaylee hello what are you working on i'm working on a costa rica video right now and oh. i'm doing paper transitions so before i'm gonna okay. ultra key out that blue okay and it's gonna look really cool. She was literally putting in the work right here. Literally printing out the piece of paper and like. But like, I'll show this. This is the behind the scenes, guys. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Oh wow. Put me to the test, got a lot on, I'm trying to take out the rest, couldn't know my lines, I'm sending them but the